Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Once you have created a chart that you have formatted in the manner that you like, you can save the chart as a custom chart template. Doing that will save any chart modifications that you have made as a chart template. In the future, you can then apply the custom chart template to other charts that you create. That saves time by allowing you to apply a saved chart format without having to reformat each newly created chart from scratch each time. To save a customized chart as a template, just select the chart that you wish to save. Next, click the Save as Template button that appears in the Type group on the Design tab within the Chart Tools Contextual tab within the ribbon. In the Save Chart Template dialog box that appears, type a name for the template into the File Name text box. Do not change the location to which the file will be saved. Then just click the Save button. In the future, you can apply the saved custom chart template to any chart that you create. So to do this, just select the chart to which you want to apply the custom chart template. Then click the Change Chart Type button that appears in the Type group on the Design tab of the Chart Tools Contextual tab within the ribbon. This will open the Change Chart Type dialog box. Click the Templates category from the list at the left side of this dialog box and then select the desired template to apply from the list of saved templates that appears at the right side of the dialog box. Then click the OK button to apply the template to the selected chart. If you want to delete a custom chart type that you have created, you can also do that by using the Change Chart Type dialog box. In the Change Chart Type dialog box, click the Manage Templates button in the lower left corner of the dialog box. Doing this causes Windows to open the folder where the template files are located on your computer. In the window that appears, select the name of the chart template file that you created and now wish to delete from the listing shown. Then press the delete key on your keyboard to delete the file. You can then close the window when you're finished. Then click the close button in the upper right corner of the Change Chart Type dialog box to close it. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.